to another video and welcome to the car park car wash. Basically we're starting a new video, a new idea that I've had to clean a random car parked in a car park in a supermarket. So basically me and Tom, Tom works for me, we're going to go to any type of supermarket, we're going to do loads of different videos, pick a random car and give it a clean without the customer knowing or without the owner of that car knowing. So the idea is they park up, we watch them park up, they then go into the shop to do their shopping, we quickly smash out a clean and then we film their reaction coming back out and we'll see what they think. I'm not sure how it's going to work out, there's a lot of risk involved in this um, and we have got to be extra careful and extra quick compared to what we normally do with cleaning. Um, so hopefully it turns out to be quite a good video and we'll just see where it goes. The risks involved are the customer could come out or the owner of the car could come out a lot earlier than what we think so they could go in and do their shopping. We need about half hour to do a car clean and they could come out a lot earlier than that which wouldn't be ideal. We've also got the problem if they might not be happy with the job that we do or they might end up saying that we scratched their car or something like that so we have got to be really careful. So what we're going to do now, we're going to fill up all the vans, sort out all the van stuff and basically go out the car and we'll give that car a decent clean and we'll see how it goes basically. We're starting this video at Tesco and we're just going to literally fill up all the products quickly now to boost up a bit of time, speed it up a little bit and hopefully we can get a car smashed out in about 30 minutes. So Tom's just going to fill up all the products, we're going to go find a car, go find a person and basically just clean their car for free and just see how they react once they come out if it all gets time for them. So smash out, get all the products filled up, go and pick a car and then we'll basically see how it goes and see where it goes. Hopefully it turns out quite well but let's hope we don't meet any Karens. Right, so we're in the van, we're going to look for the first person's car to clean. So, we've got obviously me, Tom, he's holding the camera, he's going to help out as well. Lord's in the van with us, we just filled up all the products that we need, just so we can make the whole process a lot quicker, because we're going to park up in a spot, wait for someone to come into the car park, who looks like they're going to be doing like a proper shop. So that means they're seeing if they've got bags and going for a trolley, because if you know they've got bags and you know they're going to go for a trolley, you know for a fact they're going to be in Tesco for like a good half hour, 45 minutes. So we're going to go find a spot and basically park up, look for our victim, <laughs> I don't know if you're allowed to say that, and then um, yeah, basically jump out, smash out a car clean and then we'll wait for them to come back out and we'll get their reaction so we'll just see where it goes. The ideal person that we'd hopefully look for, I don't know, it's a difficult one, not really too sure, maybe someone older, because um, you just don't know how people are going to react. And the problem is, the main car park's so busy, the, the, further you, f the further in the car park that you go, the more the people are going to be more cautious over their cars. So, what, something like that? Possibly. I don't know, really. don't know, where, they've, don't know where they've come from. But that's the problem, you go to the back of the car park where it's quieter, but you know for a fact that people are parking at the back and are going to be the ones that are more cautious about their car. They don't want people to ding it with doors and stuff. And the closer you go to the car park, it's the ones that don't care. And ideally, you want the people that don't really care because they'll come out and they'll just be buzzing with it. So hopefully we'll get a nice blonde single mum or something like that. <laughs> and um, that is a joke, by the way. Or someone, someone who's just gonna enjoy it and appreciate it. Maybe someone who can't necessarily afford like getting their car cleaned and having it cleaned is like a little bit of a treat for them. And they'll come out and not realize that their car's been cleaned and then they'll click on. I think it'd be quite a good experience. So we'll head into the main bit of the car park and basically see what we can find and see who we can find. So this is our spot in the car park. Lord's on the lookout as well. But we're just gonna keep our eyes out for like a filthy car who we think could benefit from a clean. And we'll just watch their movements, see if they've got trolleys or see if they've got bags, see if they go for a trolley and hopefully they'll be in there for a good half hour because we're going to need about a half hour to clean it so we'll keep our eyes peeled, keep it updated and we'll see how we get on. Hopefully something small, nice little three-door car with steel wheels would be perfect. So yeah, we'll see what we can find. Yeah, we've been in the van for half hour, we still haven't really found anything. We need something parked directly in front of us with enough room to work around it that's not going to spray any crap onto any other car. So we've got all this space in front of us free and we're at Tesco. We just need something to park or someone to park like here and then we'll watch them go into the shop, pull alongside, get it for now, smash out a car clean, pull back to where we are and then just get their reaction and see what it's like. But so far we've not been able to do it at all. It's nearly half two so hopefully it'll start getting a bit busier but we'll just see what happens. We need to be quick when it comes down to doing it. It's just scouting for the right person. It's all right Lord. I've done a vote last night on my Instagram story so if you don't follow me on Instagram check out the Instagram. 
and ask for some advice. So we had 18% of people said that they'd be annoyed if they had their car cleaned whilst they were shopping without knowing and 82% of people said that they'd be buzzing. So I went on the 82% and um, went with that. Obviously eight people said that they'd be annoyed and 30 odd people said that they'd be buzzing. So hopefully if we do manage to do a car today, they'll be buzzing, but we'll soon find out. Well, I think we've found the perfect car. We've got a blue Mercedes A-Class. She's just gone in the shop. She's got a trolley and she's got some bags. So hopefully she'll be in there for about a half hour. So I'm going to pull next to it. We'll smash this out and hopefully we can get it done before she comes back out. But we'll see how we get on. This is the Mercedes A-Class, we'll come over quick. It's pretty filthy. She's just gone in the shop, so we'll smash out a clean, and hopefully she's happy. So we'll just get all the products out and we'll see how we get on. But yeah, I'm a little bit nervous for this. Let's do it. Right, we've got the first car, we've got the Mercedes A-Class, we're just out here at Tesco. Customers just gone inside, like I said, we're going to smash out the clean, got the pre-wash done, got the snow foam done, smash out the wheels, get the bodywork all cleaned up, get it dried off, and wait for the customer, or wait for the person in there to react to it. Decent pre wash, decent snow foam, it's actually done this car. A lot of good. Gone around the wheels, gone around the arches, gone around the bodywork. Get it completely dry. Hopefully, we don't um, finish it when she starts arriving, but I'm hoping she actually notices it as well. We're going to park a few bays over. Hopefully, she actually notices that the car's been cleaned because I don't know, some people might not even be aware, they might not, their car might not, not even be something that valuable to them. So, um, yeah, hopefully, fingers crossed, she actually realises that we've cleaned it. And hopefully, no one goes in and complains. Yeah, hopefully, no one goes in and complains. 
But this is the setup, the Millwall Valentin, Valentin setup at Tesco. So Tesco, if you want a little sponsored brand deal, give me a shout. I doubt that. But we literally got a car wash right over there as well. There's literally a car wash literally right there. So talk about competition. But yeah, I am probably the most nervous I've ever been. So let's get this one smashed out now. Is the other drying towel in the front, Tom? Yeah, the grey one should be in the front underneath the other towel. Yeah, I'll go with the wheels. Okay, it's just salvage all the space next to us. That's uh -huh. the worst part, all the space next to us. Yeah, I know. The one we've got is typically right here. Good. Good. Going on Facebook, this. Yeah, YouTube, TikTok, and all that sort of stuff. Hopefully, yeah. basically just cleaning random people's cars. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah, yeah. check it out. Smile, Tom. <laughs> Block out wedges or something. Yeah. Well, the wedges are this at least, I would have said. Yeah. Well, I think we're going to whack up in the van. Yeah, let's try it off. Yeah, back up again. Yeah. Right, so that's the car clean for now. If we get time, I might quickly just do the glass, maybe go over the tyres. But, right, mate. Jeez. Yeah, <laughs> he's like thinking, geez, we ain't got that much time. A bit too keen, yeah, we are getting a bit keen, but I don't know, I reckon we've got time. Yeah, so yeah, it looks mint. Let's see what she thinks when she comes out, I don't know. Hopefully she's not going to be a Karen, because that is going to be awkward. Big up Tesco. I think we'll just chuck everything in the van, Tom. We'll pull it over there. Just sit slightly Yeah. Operation clean up, chuck everything back in the van. Literally chuck everything back in the van because we ain't got long. But logically, who's going to be mad if they got a free car wash? Yeah, let me know in the comments. Would you be upset if you if you came out to your car and it was cleaned? Would you be annoyed? I can see why people would be annoyed because they think that you're not going to use the correct techniques and products and all that sort of stuff. But obviously, we don't use brushes, we don't use sponges, we use the correct methods still. We just make the products a little bit stronger. Jesus <laughs> <laughs> oh, Christ, yeah. What's wrong with your 
Yeah. What do you want? You just chuck the buckets in the yard? Yeah, all right. Or just put it back in, put the lids on, chuck the go. Squeeze it through. It'll be alright. If it spills, it spills. Alright? Yeah. Good? Yeah. So okay. so? Yeah, not bad. Yeah. Long. Yeah. Nice we are. Yeah. Yeah. Good on Tom. Find the evidence. <laughs> What's that? Find the evidence. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is how I normally check things when I'm on my own. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm the organiser. Yeah. Tom, I think she's coming. I think she's coming. Let's go. Yeah. Pretty sure she's coming. And squashy. Mate, I am. That was intense. Yeah. Right, I think she's here. Yeah, it is. 100%. Right, she's here, I think. Pretty sure. So we'll see what she's like. See if you can get a little shot. She's confused. She's confused. Hey? She's confused. Is she? Sure. He's probably confused. I don't know, but she literally just watched it with her and drove it over. Oh, God. Jeez. She's so confused. Wait there. Face, just That's like cool. just so Lord did drop she out. was buzzing. That's sick. Oh, oh mate, I'm like super stressed out now. That's good. Christ. That was mad. That was mad. Mate, I'm literally so hot. We timed that so well. So literally, as we were finishing up, I clocked there, and I was like, I need to move this van. Tom was nearly Jeez. dragging along the sides Christ of the van because so I yeah. drove off. And then she come back. We seen her. I don't know whether you caught the reaction. But she was looking around thinking, hang on, who's done my car sort of thing? So I went over to her and she was good as gold. Yeah, she was lovely. She, and like she, she said, said she was eight months pregnant. pregnant. Yeah, she said she was eight months pregnant. She would have never got around to doing it. And then, yeah, she was buzzing with that. So she was well thankful, yeah, wasn't she? Yeah, I was going to say, she really She was actually going to give us something as well for doing it. I was like, no, absolutely not. I can't do that. Just 20 quid. No, I'm joking. Yeah. It wasn't <laughs> even worth 20 quid. Like. Yeah, we need like a good afternoon off now just to calm down a bit. It's gone far, mate. It's coming. Yeah, I'll like, show you. I'll show you. So the water. I'm stressed out to bug. I literally feel like I'm going to have a heart attack. So the water has come down to there. Bear in mind, we were parked over there. Nice RS6 there. Is that RS6 or RS4 or RS6? Yeah, RS6. Oh, I'm zoomed right out. It's nice RS6 there as well, which is cool. The Lord's getting annoyed because he doesn't know what's going on. But Tom's pretty stressed as well. He needs a couple of fags after that. She's telling me, mate. <laughs> I'm just glad that she reacted in a positive way. Wait, yeah. look, Lord, what is it? Look, is she on there? Is she on there? Is she on there? Look. What, mate? Yeah, I'm just glad she reacted like positively because yeah, that would have been a nightmare say. else. She was, you, she was really people, nice problem is, when people wear masks, you can't. I know obviously you can't really judge people by how they look. When they wear masks, you can't tell what they're going to be like. And when we saw her go, I thought. I was a little bit like, oh, I'm not too sure what she's going to be like here, but... She's got a hope. She, she was buzzing at really that. Nice. She it was really nice. It turns out she was actually like quite that. local to our unit as well, which is quite cool. Yeah. 
So she took Mate. our details as well. Getting the customer at the same time, it's like, really. Stressed, it's proper stressed. Right, what's the time? Let's do another one. Now, Jacob, stuff that. What's the time, mate? Three mate, I swear to God, that was like a 15 minute clean. Like. 15, like, that was probably like, what, 45 Jeez, minute clean that dropped down to 15 minutes. Yeah, if that. Chaos, but yeah, I hope you like this. If you want to see more videos like this, what I might do next time is actually get someone out with the camera because it's a bit impossible us both trying to do it and film it. So there's probably not as much content as what I'd hoped. Um, but next time I'll get like Felix out or something like that. Yeah, but I'm yeah, I'm right. sweating, I'm stressed, I'm pretty tired now. So let's call that video there. Hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think. See you guys and girls in the next one. Ciao.